It's a member-led organisation, so it's really important that members get involved with the working groups, with council, with the board, uh, make decisions to make sure that uh, what LABC is doing is promoting their own services in their own local authorities. We provide a very facilitatory role that uh, helps our customers achieve compliance with the building regulations and ensure that buildings of the future are fit for purpose. And working with business partners, I think LABC is an excellent example of a partnership that local authority building control and local authorities promoting the building control service across the country. I think members should try and um, reach as high as they can within the organisation, particularly on the board, um, to help shape and, uh, and, and guide LABC uh, is a wonderful thing. The opportunity for me was to represent all local authorities as LABC president uh, and work with the team at LABC headquarters. I'd been on the board since 2009 uh, and seeing the hard work that they were doing to promote local authority services across the country. I decided that uh, as the opportunity came up I had to support my family, my employer, Central Bedfordshire Council and I decided to uh, to take on the role. I think LABC has achieved an awful lot in 10 years, setting up the trainee bursary scheme which David Darlington, the former president, worked hard to get off the ground. Actually working it through with the working group and, and getting involved with it and delivering it and seeing the reaction from members to LABC effectively giving them a pot of money has been quite rewarding. My biggest achievement was to give the board some direction and give the board some stability and probably also to ensure that uh, members' voices were heard and that uh, topical problems, issues were brought to the fore. I think change is probably the biggest thing that we've had to face uh, in competition with the private sector and also um, evolving into a very professional organisation. I think LABC will still be the number one trainer for building control. I'd like to see that expanded so it encompasses the whole of the building control profession uh, and, and our customers. I think there is a need for us to work with professional membership bodies to raise standards within building control and make sure that building control surveyors in the future have the right skills for the job at that particular time. I would say to LABC to embrace the changes that are ahead of us. I'm sure that uh, the construction industry as a whole is facing a lot of challenges and, um, and LABC should be right there at the forefront um, proactively leading the way. We've certainly made uh, a big difference in the industry, I believe, over the last 10 years and uh, I think we should just continue to do what we're doing very well. Mm -hmm.